Hi, welcome to our video on creating a calculated field in a CSV report. So I'm going to create a new report, but based on a CSV file that I've already been using. It's already set up. So from here, I've been using the spreadsheet quite a lot, and I keep having to redo the same calculated field. So there's actually an option to be able to add a calculated field to appear as a new column in the spreadsheet or as a new field for my report builder. To do this, I'm going to go back to the CSV stage and I'm going to go to the data. So here is where I can add in this additional field. Over on the left, you'll see an add new function or calculated field menu. And we've got a lot of different options here. We can create a calculated field. We can do grouped values. We could use a, a, a predefined formula template, timestamp conversions, or numeric conversions as well. So I'm just going to show you an example of a calculated field. Uh, so same as our other calculated fields, we simply give it a name. And then we select our calculation. So I'm going to do a very basic one here. Incidents divided by 100 and then I can save that. You'll now notice that it's added a new column for the incidence rate. From here, I simply click finish. And now this field is available in for, for me to build a report on. So I can simply drag it in and see that field available. So creating it at the CSV data level is so much easier than creating this calculated field every time I want to create a report. So it should save you a lot of time in the future. For more helpful tips, please watch our other videos.